So we're on our way to go pick up pizza and other snacks for Duke's surprise birthday party. Um, Kevin's with them right now being the distraction. So you're probably wondering who's driving. No, they're not. It's Michaela, one of our good friends goes to college with us, so she's driving us. Hopefully it all goes good. We're running a little behind, but we're getting pizza from Little Caesars and they're usually pretty quick. All right, guys, so as you can see, we just picked up our pizza. We have our chips down here. So we're headed out. Um, so yeah, it should be pretty fun. Hopefully Duke will be surprised. What do you think, Michaela? Is he gonna be surprised? Mm, very surprised. Very surprised, very. yeah. Very surprised, guys. Hopefully by the time you're watching this video, our first vlog is already up, so let us know what you think of it. So we're waiting for everybody to show up at Duke's birthday. <laughs> That's... <laughs> There's Corwin right there. Hi! <laughs> I mean... <laughs> Dress. I'm super yeah. cool. I'm cool in a dorky way. Yeah, Corwin who just just beat me at ping pong, unfortunately. <laughs> unfortunately, you have like two more rounds. You have like two more rounds until there's Carissa, whose house the party is at. I wonder if Corwin is gonna go easy on Carissa. I'm guessing. This is the main event. Carissa's dad against Vincent. Something's burning. There's burnt toast around here. There's burnt toast. You can smell the burnt toast. Oh, too much Whoa. cocaine. Put on the vlog. Xander's like the most one. He's addicted to cocaine, like that guy. Right, and you're want. addicted to meth. Exactly. <laughs> but Jasmine here, she's the worst. Yeah. Any drugs she didn't get tell. her hands you on. Tell. <laughs> she will sell anything to get. Yeah. She tried to jack my car one time to get, get some crack. Like, yeah. I actually have your wallet. See, who do you think we buy from? Yeah. I mean, Jasmine's not me. I'm supposed to be. And she's stingy too. Instead of giving me a good baggie, she gives me like stamps and seeds, stamps and seeds. I was like, nah, girl. Dang. For all those, you know, crackheads on YouTube, Jasmine's not the person to buy from. There's our happy couple, Corwin and Carissa. Uh, there you go, folks. Jasmine's not fair. Yeah. Oh. Back to the match. I don't know who's oh. winning, but it's really Corwin who's winning. No idea. I'm just too into it right now. Uh. <laughs> oh. Who's winning? What's the score? 18. Oh. Ooh, Vincent's winning. Ace. 19-16. Oh, Vincent might be the first one of us to beat Chris's dad. 1917. I mean, yeah. Corwin, what is your reaction to this, Matt? I mean, it's a Vietnamese thing no, going so on right now. What's the score now? 1820? Uh, 18, uh, no, yeah, 1820. Oh! Vincent! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> he got that. Oh! <laughs> 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 Vincent's the champ! Wow, that's the first time someone's beat my dad. Really? <laughs> we got to do a little post-match interview here. How does it feel? <laughs> Feels great. I mean, seriously, Bob, I thought I was going to go. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't my, my middle finger. <laughs> Doesn't feel too good. Yeah, because I'm like gripping it like super hard. That was a good match. I enjoyed that match. Right, what a great way to leave Arizona, right? <laughs> yup. Do I get a trophy too? Or something to show for? You know, we should make them a trophy. Yeah, we'll make a trophy out of cookies. Yeah. Just cookies. Chocolate ones? So now it's Duke playing. Chris's dad's record now against us is like 15 and 1. Yes. My record against Chris's dad is now at 0 and 6. To you, Duke. Oh, too early. I saw me. Get some of this cake. <laughs> Where that knife at? Okay, so it is 1:11 right now, and we're on our way to California to go to San Diego for a day trip. It's kind of spontaneous, I guess. We're going to uh, California because we thought it'd be fun to go to the beach for a day. Uh huh. 
then why isn't Kevin here with us? Because he, he, he doesn't have a pair of balls yet. He has a vagina. <laughs> I have a feeling he's going to edit that out. <laughs> we just entered California and, and it is 3.28. So we made it in about two and a half hours. We're making great time. Didn't get stopped by Border Patrol so yet. Border Patrol must be coming up, and they'll always <laughs> stop me because I'm motherfucking Mexican. They're racist, I swear to you. They're racist. You want the video of them asking you really weird questions? Yeah. Like, what's your business in San Diego? Yeah, I'm going to the fucking beach. Is that a problem with you officers? <laughs> there you have it. We'll be in San Diego in about 171 miles. miles. We just saw the sign. Probably about another two hours, two and a half hours of driving. So we'll see you then. We okay, just guys. passed Border Patrol and this like white old dude like got to go ahead. But as soon as they saw the fucking Mexican, they stopped me and they made me roll down my window. And I was like, oh, what's your um, citizenship status? It's fucking US. I'm not from Mexico. Fuck you. Thank you. That's all I wanted to say. Fuck them. All right, so we are in downtown San Diego. It looks pretty nice. We're heading to the convention center. Check it out to see what it's like because we're going to try to go to Comic-Con. This hotel, it costs so much fucking money to stay there. Looks like a nice, all these look like nice hotels. Yeah. We're not gonna stay at any of these for Comic Con, I know that. So we're heading to Chula Vista now to get some type of food that I've yeah, never it's heard of. Mosty Locos. Right. <laughs> I guess you can't get them in Arizona, so. You can get them in one place, but. So we're saying goodbye to downtown San Diego. Very nice city. We're in Duke's old hometown, heading to go get carne asada fries now. I'm just throwing this out here. Those toasty locos are disgusting. Take a picture of it. They, I, they are so bad. Like it's not even funny. No, that that's one person's point of view. Because look, turn it around, Santa, turn it around. It had pig skin in it. It had chaka chaka, first of all. Which is pig skin. <laughs> it was, I love it. Like, I'll eat, I'll eat those all day. Xander doesn't like it. it. I mean, it doesn't look as appetizing as normal food would, but it's so appetizing. I'm gonna turn people off from this. <laughs> Just look at that. <laughs> Just look at that stuff in the middle, that's pig skin. That is dried pig skin. That's not dried pig skin. Some sort of pickled vegetable in it with some... No pickled vegetable. The sauce just tastes terrible. Xander has horrible tasting food. Look, there's a Buffalo Wild Wings right there. That's where we should go eat. Anyway, I'll have to get hopefully the carne asada fries here. Okay. Well, we made it. We are at Imperial oh. Beach. Walking in the sand, there's the pier right there. Just ate. Delicious carne asada fries, right in there? Uh huh, they were good. So we're just relaxing. We have like a long time to chill. in San Diego. Yeah. They want it. Hey guys, just chilling inside Spirit now. Hanging out. They got a lot of creepy stuff. Come on, Dan. Something that we need. Don't talk to that witch. Huh? Are you talking about the snake's gonna pop and I already want to buy it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't 
dude trying to scare me a spirit. <laughs> Dude's gonna get some Batman stuff. We're really just trying to kill time to avoid getting stuck in traffic. That's where you go. Mama goes on a ride, Woody. See? So we are heading out from San Diego now. Long day, got a long drive ahead of us. The only thing we really have to look forward to is getting stopped by border control. Do you have anything to say to you? Border patrol races. I think he, that, he's gonna take that to the grave. They are, for sure. <laughs> well, today was a fun day. Got to see your, some of your family. Yeah, I got to see some of my family. Got candy. Went to the beach. Saw some hot girls. A lot. Of a lot of girls, actually. <laughs> yeah. Walked around the mall. It was pretty fun there, too. Successful day. Alright, guys, so... We're back in Arizona. Um, we, found, we found this lovely place for Kevin. Yeah, so I'm gonna turn the spotlight on so they can see you. I think, Kevin, if you go here, you might get a girl, bro. I'm telling you, it's a major possibility. Yeah, hopefully we can go ahead and grab it on camera for you. This should be coming up any minute now. Oh, you're tired. Should have bought a monster. I only got an hour of sleep. Well, whose fault was that? <laughs> Dateland, Kevin. You know, we're gonna send you there for vacation. 